Hi guys, this is Brian McLaughlin with LearnToGrapple.com. We're going to review today one of our fundamental submission chains or sequences, our armbar triangle armbar drill. This is one of the first things that um, kind of the intermediate to beginner student will learn as a way of linking their submissions together. And it's something that will carry you all the way from white belt to black belt. You still see this applied at all levels of the game. It's an absolutely incredible drill and we're going to look at it today. So I begin with this on in my guard. I'm going to slap an armbar on. Whichever way you like to do an armbar, go for it. There's a million different ways. I just like swinging the legs up and over. Once I'm in this position, Hassan's going to do what people, especially Nogi, will commonly do. They're going to rip their arm out. Once he does, I have to act quickly because I don't want to be left in this position allowing him to pass. As his arm goes away, my leg has to open. I want to use the momentum of my leg opening to cut a hard angle, pull his arm across, close my triangle choke. Now, there's a lot of things someone can do within a triangle choke, but the most common thing you're going to see initially is posturing up. Once they posture up, this can open my triangle. As soon as I feel the posture coming, I cross over, I'm going to hit the arm lock. For this one, there's some debate which way is the best to cross, but the point is, for this last arm bar, it is okay to cross your ankles. I've finished plenty of arm bars this way in competition and drilling. I lift up and I have to finish. The biggest flaw people will have with this is they'll go very fast with the techniques, but they won't flow well. It's not the speed of the technique, it's the time between. Meaning it doesn't matter if I hit an armbar very fast, but if he pulls out, I kind of have to think about it to go into my next maneuver. I want it to just flow evenly, like you're in cruise control, never tapping the brake. The other thing is making sure that we're ambidextrous with this move. Drilling down both sides. So that's our armbar triangle armbar sequence from the guard.